Okay, and so with the guerrilla operations out of the way, I think we wait a few days to see... Yeah, let's not do that. Let's wait a few days making contact here in order to see if we can get some of this research and experimental ammo complete, I think. Yeah, and then I think base base attacking. I am sure you will find the oh, to be right. Awesome. I do, now our heavy units are going to be even better. We got beam cannons. Uh, devised a more powerful high volume beam weapon for our grenaders requiring substantial effort, but the firepower it brings is unquestionable. Uh, and then we're going to ignore all this stuff because I think we're going to do the final research in the shadow chamber. Change slash view, and this will take five days. Is that five days? Six days. And I, you know. Do you have to purchase the heavy cannon? Yes, probably. Which we might have the supplies for. We're at 180. So buy items, weapons. No, we need another 70. Okay, so we'll have to go to the black market then. Uh, sell. Hmm. That gets me some. That gets me some more. We have a lot of alloys. Yeah, I was going to say, I wish I knew how many uh, you needed to build stuff. Build you can sell a bunch of those trooper corpses. Trooper like corpses. the shield bearer oh, corpses. Yeah. Oh, and that gets us to like 80 already. Yep. That's actually an aspect of this that I keep forgetting that we can do is like the whole selling. Oh, these are worth 67. Wow. Uh, it, you just researched those for intel, right? Yeah, which we should probably hang on to because we are low on intel. Fire the beam cannons at the enemies. Uh, <laughs> shard gun. Lol. Shotguns. I I don't think I've used shotguns in quite a long time. Once you realize that you can swap out uh, assault guys. Yeah, with the normal plasma weapons. Yep. Oh, no. Locked. I don't want to click on that. I want to click on making contact for India. and we're so close with this next uh like shadow project i kind of feel like maybe we just wait it out because we can get the shadow project to happen Ooh, void rift cool continue training fuse i haven't really found super useful the grenade thing yeah, yeah like and it, at best it's gonna do like four damage by blowing up the grenade they're holding and really really at best the main thing i think it's used for is not getting a grenade thrown at us mm-hmm but usually we kill them before that becomes a problem. I'm going to go with sustain so that we don't lose this character. So uh, I should have read that, but basically sustain makes it so that if she dies, instead she's reduced to one health. And it can only happen once per mission. And she also goes in stasis at one health. Mm -hmm. So I could like run her all the way forward, alert everyone, and then like want, they'll blow her up, but then she'll live with like one turn to spare. Uh, and we got more Talon rounds. That's not cool. Nah. Eh. I don't think we, like, other than our one sniper we usually take on a mission, I don't feel like we really need any more Talon rounds. I wonder if we can sell it. Oh, we don't have enough supplies. I was going to get the Wrath suit next, but maybe we just try one more experimental ammo, because that only takes cores. Mm -hmm. Rather than go sell a whole bunch of stuff again. So we'll just try again. Roll the dice! Come on, armor piercing! Come on! Uh, in case anyone's forgotten, we're trying to get armor piercing so that our gunslinger will be able to use her pistol and be more effective. At least that's the hope. Yep. So we heard you have an alien base. We're here to destroy it. And we brought pizza. You did order pepperoni, right? Reading you loud and clear. Oh, new income, 72 supplies. Oh. We are now at 26 intel and 14 supplies. Maximum. Maximum supplies. Uh, we don't need anything here. We got four days until the, the main objective research is done. So what can we do for four days? We could get alien alloys. Or we could get alien alloys and crystals. Or we could go back here and build faster. Which I don't even think we're building anything. Well, let's go see if there's anything else we could switch that up for. Could we change it to something else? 
Probably not because we have no resources. Hmm. Not weight, Welcome resistance, medical assistance, don't or even gathering. Have 25 tell. supplies to switch. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, we we can do that though. Let's. That actually doesn't sound like the worst idea. Like go to black market, sell like one or two more things, get twenty five supplies, switch it to intel gathering, and then just go from there. Wait four days, because I have a feeling that that shadow project may just lead to the last mission. Yeah, good point. And so, if I have to choose between doing another one hour mission or doing the final mission, maybe final mission. Yep. Is there any like crashed ship stuff? No. Oh, these are just like other. Like, I can get rid of my hazmat suit. I could get rid of the talon rounds. Yep. Done. Which, essentially, I just converted a core into a talon. Or into 31 supplies. Bye. And spend the time. New construction. Alien facility coordinates locked in, Commander. You built in a location I don't have access to, didn't, didn't you? All oh, right. man, there's only three more pips on the Avatar project. Well, we got three days. Everyone just recovered. Oh, and here we go. Central, Commander, excellent. My analysis of the fragmented codex data is almost complete. The information I've uncovered so far outweighs the loss of the Shadow Chamber, as you'll see. Is that an elder? Haven't seen one in at least a decade. Yes, and I believe I now understand why. The elders appear to be afflicted with an aggressive form of tissue degeneration, rapid muscular atrophy, to a degree I had not even thought possible. So they're dying. Sounds like our job just got a whole lot easier. As with most things involving this adversary, it's never quite that simple. The Elders have been aggressively searching for a cure to their condition for centuries. Each time they encountered a new species, they procured what genetic information and material they required and moved on to the next world. Until now. I believe they found something in us. Something important enough to cause them to take root. A cure? Not that I can determine. Several key files were previously deleted, it's part of something called the Avatar Directive. Avatar. We need those files. Were I to gain access to a fully functioning codex, I might be able to recover them. Or blow the entire ship to hell this time around. I didn't say I needed the creature here, Bradford. I am confident I could access the unit remotely, provided your soldiers can get close enough to it in the field without destroying it first. That we can arrange, Doctor. Our soldiers are expendable. We could do that. We can send someone directly at it. Uh, use the skull jack on a codex. I feel like you've done that. It looks like we've got our work cut out for us, Commander. Huh. Yeah, I also feel that way, but maybe we didn't. Maybe we only ever used it on, like, uh, normal soldiers. Yeah, that thing. Plasma Lance. Yeah. So then that leaves us with uh, a generic object uh, objective of just doing a skull lance, skull, a skull jack on a codex. And that should be pretty easy. We can just go to one of these facilities, right? Mm -hmm. These will tell us if there's codex. That is codex. Where do you... Oh, yeah, right there. Middle. Okay. Uh, so what do we got here? We got elite officers, elite shield bearers, heavy mechs, gatekeepers, codex, sectopods, elite troopers, and elite lancers. That's a lot of elites and a lot of mech units. Yep. What about the other one? This only has nine, including codex, sectopods, uh, sectoids, elite lancers, elite troopers, gatekeeper, and elite shield bearer. Seems a lot easier. Let's get rid of the nine. We're coming for you. I wonder why they're different. Like why nine would one would have nine and why one would have like eleven? Maybe the India base is a lot newer. It's not as established. That's possible. And this is only a difficult too. It's not even a very difficult. So I guess we could keep with the rookie team. So now we have sniper specialist. Oh, look at their new guns. Specialist. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Did the weapon upgrade to the newest version too? Uh, like which Blue one? Fury. It's the new. Uh, like plasma gun cool it is yeah yeah just it upgraded with all of its mods nice 
if this is the case, I mean, this doesn't give us any rangers, but... You, it's a difficult mission. You could drop uh, uh, Candyman for a ranger. Yeah, we could do Zorin. Yeah, this isn't the worst idea. Yeah, let's give this a try and start passing some items around. Yeah, I, I think this good. is fine. This team worked out. We're basically just switching out Pudro for Zorin, but Zorin has the ability to recloak, which could be helpful for scouting. So yeah, let's give this a try. Most important thing is to skulljack a codex. And if that means splitting one so that it clones so we can get closer or whatever the case might be, we'll just have to make those risky maneuvers. Yep. Operation Severed Dawn. Cutting off the dawn. We severed it. <laughs>